Hello everyone, my name is Hannah Rusco and I'm a Nutrition Education Coordinator here at Cleaners Community Food Bank. Today, I'm going to demonstrate how to make spiced peach muffins. So I'm going to go over the ingredients that you're going to need to make the muffins today. First, you're going to need one can of peaches and 100% juice, a quarter cup of water, a half cup of sugar, two and one quarter cups of flour, a half teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, one teaspoon of cinnamon, three fourths teaspoon of baking soda, three fourths teaspoon of salt, and two eggs. The first step is to preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and grab a 12 count muffin tray and grease each section down with a non-stick cooking spray or with any oil you have. We're going to start by adding in some of the dry ingredients. So first we're going to add in the flour. If you have whole wheat flour, that would be the best because it has some extra fiber and it gives you some extra nutrients. Next we're going to add in the pumpkin pie spice. If you don't have pumpkin pie spice, feel free to sub it out with added cinnamon or nutmeg. And now we're going to add in the cinnamon, the baking soda, and the salt. Once these are all in here, you're going to want to take a spatula and just lightly integrate all of it together so that it's in one clean mixture. Just like this. Next, we are going to grab the two eggs and I like to crack them into a separate bowl first just to make sure that if you have any shell breakage, that you can contain it and it won't go into your mixture. Here's our two eggs. I like to whisk the eggs up first, just so the yolks and the whites are well integrated together. And then we're going to add the eggs to our dry ingredients, along with the sugar. Now we're going to mix them all together, and it's going to be kind of sticky, but that's good. That's what we're looking for. Next, we are going to add the peaches with the juices. So you're going to want to add that extra moisture to the dry ingredients, along with the water. While you're mixing, um, you're going to want to try to chop up the peaches into about half of the size or whatever kind of size you're looking for, bite size though, and slowly mix it all together until it forms a nice dough-like consistency. Next, you're gonna to wanna to fill the muffin tray. I like to use a quarter cup ice cream scooper because it makes it very even and easy, but you can use whatever you have on hand. So I'm just gonna fill up this, this scooper and place a quarter cup of batter into each slot. Once your muffin pan is filled, you can stick it in the oven for 25 minutes or until golden brown. Once your muffins are done baking, your final product will look a lot like this. These make a really great after school snack or an on the go breakfast. If you want to check out some more recipes, look up gcfb.org for more. Comment below if you tried out this recipe and let us know how it goes. Thank you so much and enjoy!